Hello and welcome to another video. Today I'm visiting Hard Knot Roman Fort which is located part way up Hard Knot Pass which is the steepest road in England. Let's see how we get on. You'll have to excuse the wind, I'm sorry about that, it's uh, top of a mountain. Um, there's a couple of places to park if you come into the fort, you can probably see there's a car there. I've actually parked, well, you can't see, just down behind this this hill here and, uh, and walked up this, this bank, which is why I'm out of breath. But anyway, that's the Roman fort, or what's left of it anyway, built in about 120 AD by the Romans. Hence it's a Roman fort, obviously. Oh, so why did they build a fort right here up this mountain? Well, look at that view. That's fantastic. Down the Esk Valley. They also had a fort down at Raven Glass on the coast and they had the fort at Ambleside, which is on the other side of this pass. And uh, they were the first ones to build a road actually over the top of the mountains because being Romans they thought, well, we've got a fort on the coast and we've got a fort here in Ambleside. How do we get to between the two? Straight line, straight over the top of the mountain. And there it is, that's Hard Knot Pass. Follow that road over there and you uh, get to Ambleside. Got about six foot of the uh, perimeter wall left standing. And uh, what I believe from uh, reading up about it is you've got this slate layer here. See this slate layer, this layer of slate here. Everything below that is Roman. Above it was added later on. Don't know how much later on, but it was added later on. So uh, I say about six foot left of the wall all the way around. And if you look at the plan of the fort, you'll see there's four openings on each side of the fort. Um, Google Earth has a good view of the fort. We'll go in one of the openings now on the side, see what we can see. The site's uh, operated by the National Trust now and they've got little um, boards up here and there, shows you what the fort would have looked like uh, when it was built. Some ruins of buildings in the middle here of the fort. Medio Bogdom. That's up. Oh nearly fell. Medio Bogdum, that's the uh, the original name of this fort, the Roman name of this fort. It's called Hard Knot Roman Fort now because it's on Hard Knot Pass, but Medio Bogdum, that was the original name. Praetorium, the commanding officer's house. Hmm. It's this one here.
I imagine in the midst of a cold Cumbrian winter it would have been quite bleak up here. There's about 200 soldiers based here and uh, goodness knows what they did to keep warm. This place is well off the beaten track. There's no gift shop, there's no visitor centre, there's no car park, really. It is not the easiest place to get to, but when you do get here, the views are fantastic. Just up here, I don't know if you can quite make this out on, on the film, but it's like a, a flat, this area here, like a flat, levelled off area. That apparently is the old parade ground for this fort. You can probably hear the wind. Uh, it's the end of October now, so just thinking, uh, this fort was occupied until about 400 AD, so 200 soldiers stationed here in the middle of winter, taking the walk from the fort up here to the parade ground. It must have been pretty bleak to be stationed here. Of all the places in the Roman Empire, <laughs> why would you want to be stationed here? Beautiful in the summer, of course. I mean, fantastic views. But in the middle of winter, it must have been pretty horrific. We have the parade ground here. Moving round the fort itself. And just down here, just in front of the fort, One more set of ruins, and that is the old bathhouse. As I've said, if you do want to come and visit here, it is very, very difficult to get to. Hard Knock Pass is a bad road at the best of times, and in the middle of winter, it's impassable. It's a single track road. If you meet something coming in the other direction, you could be stuck for five or 10 minutes, like I was actually earlier today on the way here. Be very careful if you come in here. Park sensibly, but enjoy it. If you do come, enjoy the view, enjoy the fort. It's a hidden treasure. Just another top tip if you are heading in this direction, make sure you've got the right footwear on. It's uneven, it's wet, it's boggy. Make sure you're dressed appropriately. That'll do then for our visit this morning to Hard Not Ford. Hope you've enjoyed the video. Make sure to subscribe to the channel for more videos from in and around Cumbria and the surrounding areas. And also some videos from wherever we go on our travels as a family. Hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.